to like your childhood. What, um, <laughs> what do you think that you might have done if you didn't get into singing? My childhood, you know, I always sang, but if I didn't end up singing, well, you know, my parents thought I was going to be a lawyer <laughs> or a professor. And that my sister is actually my, my legal counsel. So that's that she really? ended up being the one that was, and they thought that she was going to go into entertainment, mm -hmm. but then she kind of, you know. Was she older or younger? She's younger, but she just, it was just like growing up, her room was the messy room with mm -hmm. the, the pink and the white, and it was messy, and it was like, posters on the walls. Mm -hmm. My room was quiet, beige, with the Mona Lisa hanging up, with the Encyclopedia Britannica running alongside, oh, and like wow. the Atlas. So <laughs> they were just confused, mm -hmm. like, wait, what? <laughs> you mm -hmm. know what I mean? It was like a complete change. But, um, you know, I decided that I wanted to do this, and it's just something that kind of just came naturally. It wasn't like a plan at first. Mm -hmm. And then, it, then, it, then I finally said, you know, this is what I want to pursue. Your parents were supportive? Well, my mom cried first. She oh. was really, really disappointed. Really? She really thought I was going to be a professor <laughs> or like a writer. You know, because I went, to, I did go to college and I was, you know, an English major. I went to Georgetown, yeah, which so is Ivy League. They were just so. like, and then even then I started talking about, well, you know, if I do get a record deal, I plan on maybe leaving. And she was like, no, no. And I was like, it's been here for like 200 years. School's not going anywhere. Mm -hmm. Me on the other hand, I gotta make moves. I gotta she was just like against it. So it's good that you know everything happened the way it did and I actually finished and everything. And you did finish. Know, I did, I finished. And wow. That was great. So do are, so that, is that, that something that's good. important to you? Because I know like in the um, Asian culture, they're very education. much education based. You know what I believe? Um, although I did finish um, at a great university and I could spend my whole life studying. I really come from the standpoint of, in life, you have to do what you want to do. I don't, I advocate education for like young people. Definitely, at least go to high school. I don't know what you're gonna do without that. <laughs> but you can't just, when you go to college, you. what I do th think is that you learn about people. That's, I can't even tell you everything that I learned as far as like scholastically what I was learning. I can remember some things vaguely. But I can remember the lessons that I learned about dealing with people, dealing with my own time, dealing with deadlines, all that stuff. But really, if you go to college and your goal is just to, I'm going to college, you got to ask yourself why you're going. Mm -hmm. if, sometimes you can go to college and you just learn how to work for someone. Now, if that's the thing that you want to do, then maybe that's the way to go. You just have to figure out what your passion is in life. Mm -hmm. you know, so I don't think that college is for everyone just because you just have to go. Mm -hmm. Life is short, you need to live your life, and you need to just follow your own path. But I do believe in education. Okay. But it's just to do what? Yeah. Because you can get a huge education and have that great diploma, and once layoffs start, it you is. might just be out of a job just like someone who only has their GED. Mm -hmm. So just follow your passion. That's your passion.